Don't forget, we're only through half of this monumental semi-finals evening. Coming up, Ali Farag, the current world number one, taking on Tariq Momin, the current world champion. Kareem Abdul Gawad, the number three seed, will play former world number one, Mohamed El Shabagi, currently the number two seed. Thank you. Dream start for Momin. Yeah, the funny bounce where Ali Farag is all to see here. Well, there we go. I mean, it, it's a complete... This, this should have been done and dusted, PJ, by moment. Now we've got a very confident backhand volley drop Six, going in. 10, game ball. And he's within four points out of nowhere. Well, I mean, this, this is... is... Get, he can't believe it. He's in absolute turmoil here. Oh, that was a nerve-wracking boast. He shrugs his shoulders, but, I mean, it was in his hands there. There's nobody to blame apart from Tarek Moment for letting Ali Farag into the door. He only needs a little inch, Ali Farag, and then he'll squeeze through any gap. <laughs> well, there was the opening left by Tarek Moment. I mean, he was literally at game ball 10-2 within a four minutes and then let it slip. I'm not sure if he's, I don't know if he's feeling okay, Tarek Moment, but I mean, 10 2 up, Joey, and he's literally won. He's trying to do the calculations, 10 2 up. <laughs> not very many points <laughs> since that 10 2 lead. Uh, but if my mass serves me right. Three game balls for a two-love lead. We're looking at under 20 minutes here, PJ. Yeah, hasn't quite uh, caught fire, unfortunately. We did have a sense that the yeah. effect of last night may be too much 11, seven. for Ali Farag. And there you see the raw aggression of up. Tarek Moman. Important two-love lead for the Viper. Brilliant, lovely. absolutely so, brilliant. I mean, it was fed shot. on her plate for Ali Farag. He set the point up beautifully with the backhand length, and pushed moment into the deep left-hand corner of the court. And then look at the finish here. Yeah, it's a beautiful shot. Yeah, it's beautiful. Would you say that Tarek moments probably got one of the best floaters in the business. When he plays it like this, Joey, yeah, beautiful. Farag takes this, will go bonkers to kind of ignite the battle between these two. I certainly think that uh, he's the crowd favourite, Farag, and we'll see a big reaction oh! from him. So Farag responds. A lacklustre first two games. The world number one, the defending champion, starts to hang tough. It's woken up a little bit, Farag. There's a bit more belief and certainly a lot more fight. That's a good squeeze. Well, it's the first a really rally. Sorry, Pige, the first really tight, consistent shot for moment for quite some time. And out, six off.
I think you've got to give so much credit to Ali Farag that's created this kind of this style of play from Tarek Moman. There's no fluidity or consistency to Tarek Moman. He, there doesn't seem to be any sort of game plan. Going to get the strokes. Ali Farag has got a bit of a Houdini that helped by Tarek Moman considerably. He looked like he didn't want to know for the first two games, Ali Farag. And what do we have, TJ? Anything can happen now. How busy Ali Farag is now. He's absolutely flying around the course. The quickest we've seen him move in the entire match. It's a lovely shot. That's a tremendous shot from moment. And there we go. Farag's talking about the movement. He's just signifying the movement of Tarek Moment there. To the referee. And out, 7 6. Sometimes he didn't do anything wrong, 7-6. Although he went the wrong way, Sheldon Anderson saying there was enough interference and he was able to adjust to get the ball back. Oh my goodness me, that's a bit, bit special, PJ. That was a bit special. It was a dreadful serve at the side wall and he's absolutely threaded this into the nick. Talking about leaving it all the way to the last minute. Oh! He's got it. Ali Farag's got it. It's unbelievable. That was unreal. This is ridiculous court coverage. He's lonely lobbed it out. Oh, he's out of court. He's conceded it. Tarek Moman takes Three it in the end. Two. Ali 11, Farag, eight, what a battle 11, for seven, seven, him. Farag. Just patting Tarek Moman on the top of the head. Well, oh, Tarek Moman went through so much mental turmoil. But you would never have thought that it was going to get that out of hand, really, even with the quality that Ali Farag can, can produce. Three game to two victory for Tarek Moman. I wonder who he's going to play next. Read it. Brilliant. High quality squash from El Shibagi. Fantastic exchanges and accuracy into the front left. He reads the cross court and then whips the post around. He's, he's doing. Fellow players in that face. Goodness. Strong, Shibagi looking to really turn the screw. This is a very high tempo, he's guessed it. Oh, he's got him. Oh my word, how's he done this? How's he done it? PJ, how's he done it? How does he do it? That was unbelievable. I thought he was going to give up that rally and then suddenly produce that wrist action. He was really struggling. And out, 8-10. Game ball. Full stretch, how does he do that? Well, the referees felt the ball was to the left. Oh, he's made a shocking error. That is a nightmare error. Shibagi, 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 Shibagi clenches his fist and says yes. As Gouad hits the tin. That's all. Oh my god, that's an absolute scandal! That is scandal! Oh, PJ, Five, say three. something.
I'm absolutely speechless. I mean, you can't teach that, Joey. You can't teach that. for the winner. <laughs> you know, this is calculated from Shivagi. Seven, five. Oh, wow, that's a great shot. Well, he hasn't reviewed that. Two game balls for Shibagi. He's had to really work hard. Hustled his way at the very end there. Well, that's very clever. 11 eight, very, game very two, clever. Shibagi. He is holding him off. Leads, two games the beast low. of Alexandria gone through a very very tough second game and he's played it brilliantly towards the back end yeah this is uh, moments away now from Mohamed El Shabagi booking his place into the final eight match balls for Mohamed El Shabagi he's done a real job mentally on Kareem Abdul Gawad Psychologist. I mean, you would literally be full time with Kareem Abdul <laughs> And it's 8 10. So, I mean, imagine if he's serving to his forehand, the way Mohamed Al Shabagi's feeling, he's going to just go for a cross court nick. 10 2. And he does. And he has. There you go. I know something about the game sometimes. Three games to run. 11 9. 11 8. 11-8. Into the final, Mohamed El Shabagi yet to drop a game in this competition. 48 minutes, 11-9, uh, 11-8, 11-8, three games to love. So the finalist, I mean, it was guaranteed. Uh, somebody in the crowd was trying to be very, very funny, saying that it's going to be an Egyptian in, in, the, <laughs> in the final. It's obvious when you've got four playing in the semis. But it's a, a moment El Shabagi final.